Hi guys, Nature Guy X46 here, and today we are talking about light pollution. Light pollution is the inappropriate or excessive use of artificial light. So if you go out at night, if you live in a major city, you're not going to see the night sky like you normally would. It is just as bad as water pollution, air pollution, or land pollution. This pollution, unfortunately, is a major side effect of modern life. And again, all you have to do is visit any major city at night to see just how bad this pollution is. We live in a world where our skyscrapers are lit up at night, where there are street lights all over the place. It's endless. We live in a world where many areas are overlit. Four years ago, 99% of the people living in the United States did not experience the night sky under natural light. Meaning that they were not experiencing the night sky with a moon, with just the moon and the stars. Life on Earth depends on the light from the sun, the moon, and the stars. And sadly, our lights from our cities interfere with natural light sources um, at night. Not during the day, not so much. We don't worry about that too much. But at night, it's a major problem. You might think, why does this matter? Well, let's talk about that. So for one thing, lights at night leads to more energy being used than during the day. Sorry for that creepy smile. Light pollution can provide prey with more light to see by, thus reducing a predator's ability to hunt and make kills. It can impact reproductive cycles of animals who depend on natu natural light to signal breeding. Um, an example of that is not so much reproduction, but baby sea turtles oftentimes cannot find the ocean in some areas because of light pollution. They depend on that sun or moon rather over the horizon in order to find the ocean. It can impact animals migrating, um, birds and butterflies and whatnot. Um, birds oftentimes collide with buildings or um, or windows buildings, I guess, all together. Um, it can lead to a multitude of other problems. And believe it or not, it can affect us. It can halt the production of melatonin. Melatonin helps keeps us healthy by inducing sleep, giving our immune system a boost, lowering cholesterol. Um, unfortunately, um, light pollution can also lead to cancer, and it can also cause cognitive issues and motor skill issues. And there's more to list. This form of light pollution, like I've already said, is as bad as any other type of pollution that man makes. And it brings the problems, and it brings problems as all other forms of pollution do. So I ask you to share this video, give it a like, subscribe if you're not, click that notification bell so you know when my next video is coming out, and one last thing, if you doubt that light pollution is a thing, go outside tonight, look up into the sky, count the stars, and then drive out to the country and look at the stars. There is no doubt in my mind that this is a very real issue, and with that, I'm going to say goodbye.